What is it about photography that captures you so much? Um, I always think that pictures, uh, a picture paints a thousand words. Um, I think a good picture, you, you don't need to work the words to go with it. You know, if you look at that picture, it should tell its own story. And um, to me, it's always been an escape, so to say. You know, if you want your quiet time, you just go out and just sort of on your own to gather your thoughts, and it's just something that I enjoy. How does it feel to serve the country and take photographs for the British Army? I think it's great, you know, I think I'm quite lucky in the sense with the job that I have because we get to record pieces of history and we get to show the general public what it is that we actually do, you know, so it's good in that sense. I think we capture the right moments just to show people that what it is that the guys actually go through, you know, I think there's a misperception sometimes and people think, you know, there's a lot of stuff that gets associated with the army that's bad, but... Um, there's a lot of good in what we do, I think. It's just showing the people what is that the guys and girls go through every day in, in their in the general um, general day-to-day -day service. What is next for you? Uh, what's next for me is, is I've, I've, as I've been recently promoted, I've moved into a video role. So I'm moving on to video. And um, so I'll be concentrating predominantly on video. And also I'm part of the combat camera team which consists of a team leader, myself, and then another photographer. So I'll be concentrating predominantly on video, and then I'll have a younger photographer under me, obviously giving a little bit of guidance there as we're going along.